Okay, so here we go. Let's start our unit on space. Now, what the first thing that we need to understand is how astronomers measure distances to the stars uh, or the scale of the universe. One of the biggest things that I want you to get from this lesson is the whole idea of parallax and how we actually measure that. Okay, so of course stars near Earth appear to move, but stars that are further away actually appear to move less or they seem to almost stay put. This is all because of a phenomena called parallax, which is just the star's apparent, so not really happening, apparent shift in position when you looked at, at it from different places. This is what we're going to be doing an activity on as well. Now, because of Earth's rotation, and we'll talk more about Earth's rotation as we move on through this unit, the sun appears to move across the sky. Of course, we know this because the sun uh, rises in the east and it sets in the west. Um, but at night, it almost appears as if the whole sky is rotating above us. Again, are stars really moving? Uh, yeah, they really are. But because they are so far away that it's just very hard for us to see. Okay, so what is the universe? The universe is all of space and everything in it. And it is enormous. It is beyond our own imagination. It goes on forever. Now, because those distances are pretty large, uh, we use what is called a light year to measure, which is the distance uh, from, excuse me, the distance that light travels in a year, which is 9.46 trillion kilometers. And this just makes it a little bit more manageable when we are dealing with those distances in the solar system. Now, because those numbers are so large, sometimes we use scientific notation, uh, which are just the powers of 10. Uh, one light year is, again, 9.5 times 10 to the 15th, um, or that really large number right in the middle of the page, which, again, too hard for us to deal with. Now, even though the distances between the sun and the planets seem small, and of course, if you look at the picture, they seem like they're almost on top of each other, they are actually really far away. The sun is 1.5 times 10 to the 11 meters away. So move that decimal point to the right 11 times. Fill it in with zeros. That is far. Okay, well that ends uh, Chapter 3, Lesson 1, uh, The Scale of the Universe. Uh, you will be doing an activity on parallax. I hope you enjoy it.